my beautiful people. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Happy Bliss Sunday. Yeah, today is Sunday and I have a few hours before I have to go to work. So, <clears throat> excuse me. I thought I would come on and, show, and share with you a small little collective haul. I got some mail from Amazon that I had ordered from a phone case for my phone and I don't know if you guys can really see it I really loved it it's the african-american girl with the headband I have my pop lock on it let me see if I can take this off so you guys can see it I should have done that uh-oh let me see I might not be able to get that off hold on for a minute okay guys sorry about that all right so I wanted to show you the case that I got from Amazon and it was it came all the way from um what is it China and they said that it wasn't going to be here until like the end of October to um, to maybe November but it came early I guess cuz I uh, did Amazon Prime I don't know but I got it and I really loved it it was 3.99 on Amazon and it had different um, patterns and I went back on and I ordered um, two more because I really love it. It's heavy duty. It's sturdy. And it really, really um, takes care of your, your phone. As long as you don't drop it on that side. <laughs> but I thought that was so pretty. And I they had three different patterns. And I could not um, figure out which one I wanted. So I went with this one first. And I just wanted to share that with you guys. Because that was really pretty. Okay. So let's get out of here. And then, so we got the Amazon. Then I went over to, um, excuse me, I gotta bend over to get this stuff. I went to Dollar General and they had um, a 50% off table set up in the front. And I really, really, really am kicking myself for not getting more and I'm hoping that when I get paid, I can go back and they'll still have them, but I really, really like, y'all know I love mugs. But they had these 50% off on their table. And these are the, it says J, Jolie plus Jace. Oh, I need my glasses. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. Let me get some specs on. Whew, I can't wait to get my glasses. Okay. So this says, Morning sunshine. <laughs> Can y'all see that? Morning sunshine. That's the one my uh no hers said morning pumpkin and she said Maroni. My sister said Maroni and it said morning pumpkin. But this one says morning sunshine. I hope you guys can see that. And on the bottom, on the back of it, it says Jolie plus Jace by Jana Kramer. And I just thought this was the prettiest mug that I have seen and they were regularly three dollars and I got it for a dollar fifty and they had a lot of them they had plenty of them I just wish I had a <sighs> I make myself so mad when I do that I should have gotten them all because they would have made great Christmas gifts my sisters love mugs as much as I do so but I just thought that was really really uh, pretty and when you drink it morning sunshine you know <laughs> anyway I got that and then they had this I guess you could use it for anything it's a ceramic organizer which I'm gonna use for my um, makeup brushes it says you look amazing and it looks like that and it has the black inside I love that and then it was five dollars it says food safe so you can put food in there if you want um, it didn't say if it was um, dishwasher safe I didn't even check to see but I wouldn't put nothing like this in the dishwasher anyway so but it says food safe so yeah it doesn't say it's um, dishwasher safe or microwave safe but it does say food safe so I don't know what that means yeah but when it doesn't say that I wouldn't I wouldn't um, I wouldn't try it but it does say food safe but it's so cute and I'm just gonna put my makeup brushes in that and that was five dollars and I got that for two fifty <laughs> excuse me and then they had again I'm kicking myself they had these 
cute, I mean cute little scented mini brooms for one dollar. And I, when I went to cash out, the girl was like, I, I think I'm going to get some of those. And I should have just reached back and got some more because they were only a dollar, y'all. And they smell so good. They smell like the cinnamon. I can't wait to hang these up on my tree. Oh, my God. I might even use them for my fall decorations. They just smell so good for one dollar, y'all, at the Dollar General. So they're called Scent Brooms. Highly cinnamon fragrance, hand scented in America, broom crafted in Vietnam, um, scented mini broom, and they were only one dollar. So I know I should have got more of those. <laughs> Pissed off as usual. Excuse me for the close up. Okay, so now we're gonna move on to, of course, one of my favorite places, the Dollar Tree. The Dollar Tree. Y'all know I gotta get my fix, right? I have to get my fix. They've been working me like a daggone runaway slave at this little part-time job. That I'm only making a little piece of change. It's my fun money, but I'm hanging in there, y'all. I'm hanging for right now. Yesterday was by far the hardest day I've had so far. And I really considered, you know, vacating, exit, stage left, or left. Yeah, <laughs> but I'm good. I got some rest. I gotta go in tonight. This will be my first night working, but ooh cha. Mm -mm -mm. Now my boss is already gonna take vacation next week, and she's talking about she wants me to hold it down. I'm like, I don't get paid to hold it down. <laughs> that that I mean, they really, really. It was so hot. First of all, it was y'all know how hot it is out here. It's like 90s, high 90s, and the humidity is so hot. It's so high, I just feel like a running faucet. I never stop sweating. And anyway, it was a rough day yesterday, but I made it through. Thank you, Lord. He doesn't always take the stuff away, but he will give you the strength to go through it. But I don't know. <laughs> so I went to the Dollar Tree, and my objective is to pick up a few ornaments like every week when I get paid. Just a couple of ornaments at a time so I don't go gaga. And I saw this one and I just absolutely love this. And I only really wanted one. You know, I know I could have gotten several, but this was just so cute. And the fact that it had, you know, Merry Christmas written on it really is what sold me because, you know, I know the red truck is really big. And where I work at, we have so many red truck um, ornaments and decorations, but there are far, far more money <laughs> than a dollar. And I just fell in love with this simply because it had the Merry Christmas written on it. So I got that one this week, all right? And I love these. And then I got this little red sled, which I really fell in love with it. For some reason, it reminded me of home in New York with the sleds in New York City around Central Park and stuff and I really 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 they had it in different colors I think they had it in silver I'm not I'm not really sure but I really did love this the sled right here and so I got that one now y'all know I haven't even gotten into my storage to get my fall stuff out so I remember specifically buying a few ornaments from Dollar Tree last year. I know I got the sled. I think I got the Christmas tree. So I don't want to go overboard. That's why I'm trying to take it easy and just get things that I know I did not purchase last year because I didn't even see, you know, ornaments like these last year. But these are the campers and they come in a two piece. And they're all merry. Um, they all say merry up top, and they all say ornament decorations, and they're all a Greenbrier product. And I just thought these were the cutest, so cute. <laughs> so I got the campers because I know for a fact I don't have those. And then my favorite, favorite, bestest one, <laughs> my favorite one is the church and they had the church in so many different um motifs of course i have to spray this down with hairspray but when i got it home and took it out of the bag it was broken on this corner right here so you can see the indentation right here so i gotta take that back and just um get one that's 
not broken, but I just fell in love with this church. Oh my God, look at that. How gorgeous on both sides. Then you have the little embellishment up here with the acorn open and the, what do they call it? I oh, can't think of them. Y'all know I'm old. <laughs> Poinsettia or persimmons, whatever those berries are. But I saw this and I saw it in silver. I think I saw it in silver. And But y'all know I'm a gold girl. So, I mean, I like silver too. But this was just so gorgeous to me. So those are the four ornaments that I've picked up so far. And I'm going to take the church back. I was looking for my receipt. I think I threw it out, but I don't care. They're going to give me a good one. Because <laughs> it came out the bag like that. So, so those are the ornaments that I've purchased so far. And I'm really, really pleased with them. I can't wait to get my Christmas tree and put it up. Even though we haven't gone to the fall yet. <laughs> and then, um, let me see what else. I think that was it from... No, that's not Dollar Tree. Then I bought some food items. Sorry for bending over, y'all, but this is life. So they had some of the palm olive, the 25% um, free for a limited time bonus. So you got a bigger bottle. And I, in one of my, I think in the beginning I showed you guys, I put it up to the regular size bottles that they had for a dollar. And so I picked up two of those, even though my sister just gave me one in one of my, um, in my extreme couponing haul, I showed you, she gave me a palm olive, but that's fine. That detergent never goes, you know, to waste in my, in my house. So I do, even though I run my dishwasher normally, I still do a lot of dishes by uh, hand. So I got two of those. Let me put those back in. And then I got... Just some more, I bought some of their coconut oil. I decided to finally break down and give it a try. And I was so happy when I opened it and it was sealed. Because I have a thing about, you know, the food being sealed today. It just, you know, makes me nervous when you purchase something and it's not sealed. With the crazy stuff that people are doing today. But I did purchase this one little jar of coconut oil. Y'all know I just use this um, to pre-pull my hair. You know, I used to cook with it, but I don't, I don't really do it too often anymore. And then I got, um, one little small thing. I realized I didn't have any vegetable oil in my house, any oil in my house. And I usually don't do that. And, um, of course I won't be grocery shopping until next, next week or a week after next. So I just picked up a little golden chef vegetable oil. And I never really paid much attention to the oil at the Dollar Tree, but I just happened to be skimming by and I saw that. So I was like, oh, good. Let me put get a little oil in the house. So you never know when you need to. Sorry. Then I got another two cans. Y'all saw me the last time I made my Franks and Beans. This is where I get my cans of pork and beans from, the Dollar Tree, because they're the only ones that I can find these size cans with the pop tops, you know, and in date for a dollar I don't even find these at Walmart's anymore not this size and this is a one pound 3.75 75 ounces of pork and beans and they don't go out until two, 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 August 29 2021 August 29 2021 yep so I got me two more cans of those because it's hopefully this heat will go away soon and we can start, you know, making up our nice pots of dishes. But honey, I ate those Franks and beans and, and biscuits and they were so good. Felt like my childhood again. Okay, now I did that one and this one, right? Okay, so in this one, I found a few more food items. And I didn't realize them when I was watching it on other people's hauls that it was so small. But I found the classic cheesecake mix, which I was looking for the pumpkin one too, because I wanted to get two of those so I could give them to my sister. I don't know, I'm always thinking about my sissies. But I got this one. I only got one. I should pro probably should have bought two, but I wanted to try them first. And then, of course, I got one of the funnel ones. 
and they're heavy. I don't know what this mix is, but it's really, really heavy. So I got the funnel cake mix and the classic cheesecake mix. And then I got these little sugar-free Werther's because I carry a couple of these in my pocket at work in case I have a low blood sugar. I can just pop one of those in. Even though they say sugar-free, they do spike my sugar. But just not like regular candy would. And I know y'all heard me say in my fall um, questions that I don't eat candy corn. But when I was running my mother around, I had left straight from work and went and got her and took her to the doctors and stuff. And when I got to her house and got her in and settled, somebody had given her a gift basket from when she was sick. And it had candy corn in it. And I just grabbed a handful of it. And ate it to get my sugar up. And dang, that candy corn was good, y'all. I haven't eaten it in so long. I thought I didn't like it anymore. But it was so good. So, when I went to the Dollar Tree and I was shopping around, I have been seeing these for a while. And these are the Brock's Donut Shop. Donut Shop candy corn. And they are strawberry glaze, chocolate glaze, and original glaze. And I can't wait to taste these. And probably all I'll do is just taste them and then just give the rest of them to my sister. Because she loves, you know, stuff like this. So I'll probably give that to her. And then I found these. Again, a name brand, Brock's Pie Favorites Candy Corn, Apple Pie, and Pumpkin Pie. What? <laughs> I've seen these, but I just passed them by because I really had no interest in candy corn. But when I tasted just the regular candy corn, somebody had put a bag of candy corn in one of my mom's gift bags. And when I tasted them, they just brought back memories. Because at one time, I did like candy corn. But, yeah, so I tried those. And if I, you know, like I said, I'll probably open them and just give them to my sister. Okay, and I think that's it for today. Did I do it all? Um... I'm not really sure. I've got some bags down here, but I think I'm going to... Oh, I did tell you guys that I decided because I enjoyed opening the um, the pack, the One Punch Men. I just enjoyed them so much. I decided to just not open anymore because I think I have four of my own left. So every week I'm just going to pick up a few until they sell out. I think this might be the last week because they emptied all the boxes out and hung them all up. So if I can make it to Thursday when I get paid, I have I need to pick up 15 more. Because she said, I called the lady who's in charge of the kids at church. And she said she has about 20 kids. So I'll do 25 just to make sure that she has enough. So I'm going to put one of these... Uh, one Punch Man in the Christmas bags like I did last year with the Beanie Babies along with a piece of Christmas candy like the chocolate Santas or whatever and give them to her for gift bags for the kids. So I had four left. I purchased six more so that's 10. So I only need to get 15 more. So I'm hoping to grab the 15 if they have them Thursday by the time I get paid. So that I can make up the gift bags later on when we get closer to Christmas. And I thought that was a great idea for the kids' gift bags. So she's really excited about it. So, And I always tell her, don't say it's from me. Say it's from Mother Lola because my mother is the mother of the church. So, I mean, I know they have a lot, a lot, a lot of... Oh, my glasses are peeling. So I know they have a lot of the... Um, canvas wall arts going around but these were the only two that I found that you know really um, that I liked to purchase I saw some of the ones with the perfume and um, not the lipsticks or anyone like that but they have so many different ones out I'm kind of looking for the um, certain ones and I went to a Dollar Tree in Raleigh last night with my sister and they had no canvas wall arts and I was shocked because this is a store that I normally find all the really nice ones so but I did find these two and either they're going to go in gift bags for my sisters or they're going to go in friend mail because I just think they are so adorable so I got two of those and then I got they had some notebooks out with your initials on it 
and they're just regular notebooks and I use these notebooks all the time for my editing and other things and writing down my notes, my doctor's appointments and I just had to get one with S on it for Sadie. <laughs> and then I found, what is this? Oh, I just had to have this little trinket tray because it had an elephant on it, you know, and I said, I know I don't have one with an elephant on it, but I'm just going to sit it on the back of my dresser with the rest of my trinket trays. You can put your rings here if you want and then put, you know, whatever you want. It's just a trinket tray, but I was just enamored with the elephant. So I got one of those and let's see what else we got. Oh, I bought another pack of my maxi thins feminine cleansing cloths for sensitive skin with soothing aloe and i really really like these guys these are very very nice um in a pinch you know and for a dollar and you get 32 cleansing cloths and they're big and they're nice and strong and thick so yeah i like those and i didn't know my sister was going to give me any pods in the extreme coupine so i got me another four pack of my cascade because in this particular Dollar Tree right here at my house, they just don't have the other pods at all. And I forget to look when I go to other Dollar Trees. So, Cascade is fine. <laughs> so I found this silicone facial mask applicator that I've been seeing circulating around on people's Dollar Trees hauls. And of course, y'all know I had to dig down and get me a purple one, you know. So that might be a gift or I might try it, I don't know. Y'all know, I'll just be spending money just to spend money. And I really do believe that that is it for this week's Dollar Tree Haul, Dollar General, 50% off table, and my Amazon Prime. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Love, peace, and happiness. Remember, guys, be kind to each other. The world is big enough for us all. I really do like these ornaments, y'all. Have a blessed day. Bye, guys. Love you.